Hey everybody, so with the NHL season starting up this week, it's time to get back to my regular Sunday series, and one of those is Games of the Week, where I look ahead to the upcoming week in the NHL and pick out which games I think are going to be the best and most exciting to watch. Now, it's going to be a little bit different this year, obviously, because the schedule is different and teams are playing sets of games for the most part against each other where they play multiple times in a row. And also, every single game this year is within your division. So normally, divisional matchups were almost guaranteed to make games of the week. But now this year, every game is a divisional matchup. So I'm going to have to make it a little bit harder to get onto this list. And it has to be a really top quality matchup. Um, and also you're going to see kind of the same matchups on throughout the week, you know, because teams are playing multiple times a week. So if it's a really great rivalry matchup, you're probably going to see it on this list more than once for each, uh, for each night. But anyway, let's get going here. Please subscribe and hit that like button. If you haven't yet, both of those things help out so much and are greatly appreciated. But let's take a look at the games of the week for the first week of NHL action. Now, we have less days for games this week uh, because the season doesn't start until Wednesday, so there's only four days of games rather than the usual seven, but it will be up to the usual seven by next week. So, first, opening night, the 13th, Wednesday night, I put all the games from Wednesday on the list just because it's the opening night of NHL action. Um, there, there's nothing like starting the season. I'm so happy that we have hockey. I'm so excited for the start of the year, so... We have some great matchups on opening night, but I am putting all of them as games of the week just because it's the first night. Pittsburgh, Philadelphia, uh, Montreal, Toronto, Chicago, Tampa Bay, Vancouver, Edmonton, St. Louis, Colorado. Some great games and a great way to start the season. Absolutely cannot wait to see uh, NHL action back on the ice and, 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 uh, and ready to go. So super excited about the first night of the year. Then on Thursday, the 14th, I have the Islanders versus Rangers. Just always an incredible matchup when those two teams play. Battle of New York. And the big thing here with the Islanders and Rangers is I think that these team, those are going to be two teams fighting tooth and nail all season long for a playoff spot. So uh, it's going to be a huge matchup every time those two play just because of, I think, how the standings are going to shake out. And it could come down to Islanders and Rangers with one of them getting into the playoffs and one of them not. So that's going to be an absolutely massive matchup every time. I also have Calgary versus Winnipeg. That is going to be a really good game. Um, I know Calgary gets kind of more talked about when they're playing uh, Edmonton. And obviously, anytime Calgary and Ed Edmonton play, it's going to be a, a fantastic game. But all of those kind of Western Canadian teams, when they play each other, doesn't matter what the matchup is. It's going to be high-level hockey, and it's going to be really, really fun to watch. So I think Calgary versus Winnipeg is, is a fantastic matchup and going to be a great game. Then I have Vancouver versus Edmonton. And again, it's usually Calgary versus Edmonton gets all of the attention. But Vancouver versus Edmonton is a pretty darn good game as well. Um, and and those, when those two teams face off, and I think they're going to be really fighting for playoff position all season long as well, similar to the Islanders and the Rangers. So um, it's going to be huge for those teams uh, whenever they play each other to get those two points. So expect that to be a great game. Very fast-paced hockey as well. On Friday the 15th, I've got a couple of games. Pittsburgh and Philadelphia play again, as they do on opening night. Obviously, Battle of Pennsylvania, huge rivalry between these teams. Always a great matchup. Always fun to watch. Anytime Philly and, and Pitt go at it, it's just... It's high-level rivalry hockey in the NHL, so really excited about that one. And then another one that uh, we see on opening night and then see again on Friday is St. Louis versus Colorado. Normally, these two teams are in the Central Division and um, and are you know division rivals there. This year, they've both been moved to the West Division because of the realignment. But uh, they're still going to be huge rivals. They're still going to be fighting for first place. And those are certainly two of your best teams in the West Division that, uh, that are going to be you know, going at it for points all season long, trying to finish first. So I expect a great matchup between those two. And then that brings us to Saturday the 16th. Uh, the Islanders and Rangers play again. So everything that I talked about with them uh, the first 
uh, for their first matchup applies to their second. Going to be a fantastic game. And then uh, also Calgary and Vancouver play on Saturday night. So uh, after Calgary starts their season against the Jets and after Vancouver starts their season against the Oilers, the Canucks and Flames then start uh, playing against each other. And that is a rivalry that's been a little quiet the past couple years. I think if you go back more to the mid to 2010s, like 2014, 2015, Calgary and Vancouver were really heated matchups and they were all over each other. They had a playoff series in 2015, but then over the past few years, that's quite kind of quieted down as Calgary's rivalry with Edmonton is kind of ramped up. I think you're going to see Vancouver and Calgary because of just the number of times that they play each other playing in the Canadian division and how important those games are going to be. I think you're really going to see the Vancouver Calgary rivalry ramp up this year. And uh, it's going to be a really, really fun matchup every time those teams play. So certainly looking for that to be a great game. So there you have it. Those are my games of the week for the first week of NHL action, Wednesday through Saturday. We'll be doing these every single Sunday. We're looking at that week uh, ahead for games of the week, and I'll be picking out the best ones or the ones that I think will be the best ones to watch each and every week. So appreciate all of you guys watching. Like, comment, share, subscribe, follow on social media. All those links are down in the description. If you'd like to further support the channel, the links to our Patreon merchandise store and donation link are down in the description as well. Keep spreading the word about this channel. Let's keep this thing growing. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video and I'll talk to you guys soon.